is a quick lesson on FreeCAD macros. Say you want to add a macro to FreeCAD. Find a macro that you want to download, for example, a pipe creation macro. Macro is a Python piece of code which adds functionality to FreeCAD. So we have here, for example, a creator for pipes, you could, which allows you to create different pipes based on a selection of length and pipe diameter. So uh, right click, save link as on this macro, create the create pipe macro, save it, save that on your desktop, and now you have to add that to FreeCAD. How do you do that? Uh, first of all, find out where your macros directory is. So in FreeCAD, go to edit preferences, and there you will see where the macro folder is in FreeCAD. So here we see, for example, if you look at macros, uh, the macro path is home marchin FreeCAD. So I can go go to my computer in a directory structure. I go to the home directory, marchin. Now here the only trick is in the home directory you have to go to view, menu, and say show hidden files, control H. Those are files that are hidden that start with a point, like point FreeCAD right here. Here's my directory that I'm looking for. So this is the macros directory. So then I will take that macro that I, then I just downloaded, which was on my desktop. So this is the create pipe macro. I drag it into here and that's it. Well, I actually already have it dragged in here, so, so skip that. Now with this macro in the folder, you can go to FreeCAD. So now let's go back to, to FreeCAD and we want to create pipes. This is one inch pipe that was created. So to use the macro, go to the macros menu, macros, and select the, the macro that you added, which is create pipe macro. Click execute. And there you go. This is the program that Ruslan has made. It's a create PVC macro. So you just select the size, for example, half inch, schedule 40 PVC pipe, one foot long. Click OK. Do we do it? Yeah, actually we did. It was it's actually hidden in there. So let's try that again. Um, so here we have one pit thing just to make sure that this works well here. So macro macros uh, go to the create pipe macro. Once again, go to here. Now we're gonna do a tiny pipe, say a three eighths inch pipe, two feet long. Click OK. Yes, indeed, that was created. So. Uh, this is a standard pipe that instead of trying to figure it out from scratch, what's the diameter and everything else, this macro allows us to do it. So it's a quick tutorial on adding macros.